ABC Chemicals created. Here's the name of our supplier record, ABC Chemical. This is the information entered from the create screen. Let's look at a few items. Here's the supplier ID. This is generated automatically by FreeQMS. Here's the legacy record ID. This is where we would enter a number from an old system. Here's the important stuff. ABC Chemical is set to evaluation level 1, but we haven't evaluated the supplier yet. As soon as we approve this supplier, this last evaluation field will populate automatically. This next evaluation field will automatically show as 6 months from the last evaluation date. Let's go down to Locations. Locations is an enhanced, intelligent feature of the FreeQMS Suppliers module. At first glance, the Locations area seems like standard record keeping. Any locations entered here, however, will automatically be selectable when referencing the supplier in other modules, such as audits. This quickly saves a lot of time compared to duplicate entry and ensures that there is only one source of data. Let's enter a location for ABC Chemical by clicking the Add a Location button. We will give ABC Chemical's main location a name of West Coast Cleaning Agents. This can be a name from ABC Chemical's marketing or however we choose to internally refer to the locations our suppliers maintain. This is a description field meant to help the user. Now let's fill out ABC's address information. Go ahead and click the Create button. Great, ABC Chemical now has a location entered. This will become very useful in FreeQMS. If we create an audit record for this company, such as when we were auditing the supplier for compliance, this location will automatically be selectable as an audit location. The more locations that we enter on the supplier record, the more we can select. Locations must be entered on the supplier record first. This means audit locations will always be accurate to supplier records. Let's go down to Contacts. Contacts are our company's contact of the supplier who we deal with on a regular basis. A great example might be a site head of quality, a shipping manager, a complaints manager, or anyone our organization tracks for the purpose of quality records. Click Add a Contract. We will use the generic name John Doe. John is the quality manager. John works in the quality department. Now, go ahead and click the Create button. Great! Now we have John entered as a contact at ABC Chemical. The Contacts field works the same as Locations, where contacts must be entered here prior to being used on audit records. It's likely that if we audit ABC Chemical, John would be our point of contact. If he isn't, we should add another contact for that person. A major problem in electronic systems and record keeping in general is duplicate points of entry. If the supplier module was not hard linked to the audits module, then users would have the opportunity to enter John's information in one way here and another way on audit records, making eventual data trending difficult and tedious. Let's continue with our supplier. Click the Parts tab. FreeQMS Parts tab is a great control for companies without a true ERP system, or companies large enough that a supplier qualification and purchasing are completely separate. The Parts tab is used to create a controlled list of parts associated with the supplier. Let's say for our supplier ABC Chemical, that our written supplier agreement, more on that in a minute, states that we can only purchase cleaning agents from the supplier. Purchasing is not allowed to purchase other materials, such as biologics, from ABC Chemical, even if they do offer. The Parts tab is a great place to upload a controlled list of parts. Purchasing can check their order against these parts. If there's a question of materials coming from an unapproved supplier, it can be referenced against this list. Click the Upload Parts button. Note this tooltip. The Parts tab accepts a CSV file with parts split into three columns, part number, description, and notes. Let's look at an example. Here we have a list of example parts for ABC Chemical. Notice, these are all the cleaning agents. Note that this is a comma-separate value file for CSV, not an Excel, XLS, or XLSX file. If you have a list of parts in standard Excel format, simply open it in Excel and resave as a CSV. Click Choose File. Click the Parts file, and then click OK. Click Submit, and voila! Your parts now appear in FreeQMS. FreeQMS can now serve as an electronic repository for tracking parts associated to a supplier. Let's check out the Linked Records tab. Go ahead and click Linked Records. This tab is currently blank. FreeQMS is focused on automatic link generation rather than manual. Links will appear on this record once this record is involved in other records, such as audits. Let's look at the Files tab. Click the Files tab.